So what's going on guys, my name is Mr. Dalek JD, and in this video I'm going to be giving you a quick and easy tutorial on how to unlock the Pack-A-Punch machine on the map Voyage of Despair. Now if you need any additional help on the other maps, including getting Pack-A-Punch on those, or various builds, or easter egg guides, or live playthroughs, or just general gameplay, I have a load of videos and a playlist linked down below for you guys to check out if you need any additional help. But if you do find this guide useful, let me know in the comments section, and if you did find it useful, feel free to leave a like rating before you leave but you don't have to but jumping in the very first thing you'd want to do is open up the map so you're from one side of the boat to the other until you're in the poop deck funny name i know but up towards the top is going to be the ship wheel and a artifact called the sentinel artifact which you want to interact with as this is going to do a lot of cool things for us in the map and as you activate it you're going to see these four bursts of energy flying around at the map which are going to activate various teleporter pads for us to access other parts of the boat which we couldn't before but just take yourself down the staircase and where you can see this first floating orb is actually going to be part of the pack-a-punch pedestal you want to activate that symbol and it's going to give us one of four of those symbols these can be activated in any order you don't have to do this in the order that i'm showing you in the video but just whatever order you come across them in your game is the way that i recommend you should do it the next area i'm going to is going to be the mail rooms leading in to the cargo hold which is just behind the spawn room so when you're in the spawn there will be a door you can open which leads you down here and if you start swimming underwater you're going to notice this portal but if you swim away from it towards the other end of the cargo hold room you're going to notice that there is a second pack-a-punch pedestal which we can interact with and that will activate that pack-a-punch pedestal right there Next location is going to be on the lower grand staircase, so in the main area of the boat, just simply take the flights of stairs and there is a lot of them all the way down to the bottom and you're eventually going to notice this pedestal on the lower grand staircase deck which you can activate that will be the third pedestal and depending on where you activate the fourth one that's where the pack a punch machine is going to form so if you want the pack a punch machine here maybe leave this one to your last as this is quite an easy location now the last pack a punch location area is in the engine room but you won't actually be able to get into here unless you use this teleporter in the millionaire suites which will take you to the provisions from there you simply turn around and open this door and you'll be straight into the engine room and this last and final pedestal involves you jumping underwater in the swampy water again and swimming through this very narrow sort of passageway which will lead you straight to the pack-a-punch pedestal and by activating this one as your final one the pack-a-punch machine will form and you'll be able to pack a bunch of weapons but after a certain amount of uses the machine will move around the map but if you learn where the pedestal locations are then you can get it easily find where the pack a punch has moved to but hopefully this was a very quick and easy guide for you to understand if you enjoyed it let me know in the comments section and drop a thumbs up and make sure you check in the playlist link down below so you guys can see all of my other black ops 4 zombie videos because there is a ton of other tutorials on the channel as well as various live gameplays easter egg hunt live streams and tons of other things but thank you for watching and i'll catch you in the next one